<laughs> Rich is waiting for me to get my act together. <laughs> He's so not paying attention. Um, anyway, we're going to go thrifting today. We're going to take you guys along. Uh, it's early. Um, I'm not fully awake yet, so give me a little bit of a break. Hopefully we find some cool stuff. We'll be out most of the day today. I'll keep you updated. <laughs> Already doing swell this morning. Came in, read the sign. Said, Monday morning, 50% off mystery furniture. So I'm thinking, what the heck is mystery furniture? So I asked the lady and she's like, no, every morning we do a different mystery item. Today, furniture is 50% off. That, uh, that makes a lot more sense. I was thinking you had to go through the furniture and find the mystery items that were 50% off. That is cute. Not for seven bucks, but it is cute. I just shouldn't function in the morning in general. I'm not good at it. And even in the quote unquote mystery furniture I'm not seeing anything. Some of their prices are a little ridiculous even at 50%. Can you go to the register please? Like that. $18.99. I'm good. Alright, let's go check the shelves. Jeez, I'm pursuing a box. Moving on. I always do pretty well with these. Jeez, still six dollars. Made in Taiwan, so I mean it is, I don't know, we'll think about that. Anything else that strikes any kind of interest? Like this. $40 a piece. That's, that's absurd. True. Alright, I do always look through this stuff for any old um, Tupperware. The sets. Always seem to do all right for me, but I don't see any today. I don't know, I'm not really seeing much of anything today. Somebody's breaking something somewhere. Mm. Old birdcage stand. I love 
love those things, but it's $18.99. So we're gonna not get it. I sold a painting that Rich really liked. So I am going to keep an eye out on the artwork today too. See if I can find a replacement for him. His room is really mid-century modern style, so oil on canvas, framed is what I'm looking for, preferably kind of large. I don't see anything here. But I just remembered I have to do that, so I am going to keep my eye out today for something. Also trying to learn clothing brands. But I really don't know anything about clothes in general. I'm not really into clothes. So I don't know. any of you know anything that I'm missing, let me know. I really should have Rich look for band t-shirts. He knows that stuff I do not. Not actual clothing, but he knows bands. He's very into music. <laughs> That's me. So me. See, like Brett Eldridge, two thousand six. Hmm. And I think it is fifty percent off. But I'm gonna leave it because I don't know anything about it. No idea what I'm doing. <laughs> uh oh. Rich is going to get that shirt. Watch his face. Alright, let's go show him. Ooh, found him and a globe. Globe's probably more than what I'll spend on a globe. Yeah, $15. They're out of their board. Alright, watch his face. Hey, babe. I'm not I'm not super sure about this one, but I was gonna I was gonna have you look at it. Um yeah, I want it. <laughs> and it is a large, so I'm going to wear that. But it's not going to be resold. <laughs> he has Lamb of God tattooed on his back. I'm not sure on the color. But it's 99 cents. It's cotton. It's a large. I think I might take a chance on it. Alright, so second thought, we're getting ready to leave here. And it looks like that has like... Can't really see it. It is. It's cracked right there. So for six bucks, I'm definitely not taking it. That's going back. Alright, we're going to hit up this little Goodwill. Uh, looks like half price. Color is pink. Let's go check it out. Gotta check the art. 
<laughs> poison oak. We know that one. I don't see anything, but I do have to be careful filming in here because the music is really loud. Oh man, I don't see anything. But some other ones down here. Nope. Must be the day. Going through the t-shirts with a dollar fifty. Does have a bleach mark it looks like there and a black mark there, so I don't know. Alright, I'm putting it back. I don't trust myself yet with clothes that have damage. I don't know enough. All right, we're gonna head into this Goodwill. The last one didn't really provide us with a whole heck of a lot. We bought one thing. So we still got a few places to hit. We just ate lunch, recharged. Let's do this. All right, the music is not bad in here. But so far, I'm not seeing anything. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, so I'm going with my gut on that one. It's half off. Which... Unopened. Found some stuff. And That's some... some good jazz. On to the next. I feel like this place is really hit or miss. It's either super overpriced. And you're kind of like, Jesus Christ, who uh, actually priced this? Sorry, I'm trying to get out of the car. Or you find that uh, super good deal. So, I found some really good stuff here in the past. But nine times out of ten, it's really the, you know, alternative of Jesus Christ, who priced this. It is snowing. Still, it's April. It's supposed to be the last really cold day, so at least we're uh, making the best of it. Here we go. Sometimes you can find some really awesome mid century sign sets. I got lucky once, so now I have a tendency to look. But I don't see anything to even check closer today. Nothing. Today is just been a really bummer type day. Sparse. Alright, so we do gotta check the artwork. through all the other stuff. So now I'm just perusing t-shirts. Not really finding anything in here that really strikes my interest either. Today is just one of those days. It's like you do really good and you find a ton of stuff or you just go out and it's a flop. 
feel like today's one of those flat days. And we are out of there. Didn't find anything. Nothing. That was a complete bust. That doesn't happen very often. But we still have, let's see, one, two, three more to, three more stops to make. All right, let's check this place out. It's like rain snowing with the sun out at the same time. Interesting phenomenon. Anyways, let's go see if we can find anything here. Kind of sucks those are in better shape. If you can see that. They're a Pyrex. So it sucks. They're in bad, bad condition. This is what I was kind of talking about earlier. But it was, it's the taller stuff. There's four of them. They fit inside each other. Those are the ones that I keep my eye out for. And I don't see any. I don't know about those other, the green stuff that I was just looking at. I don't, I've never dealt with those things before. So, I'm gonna leave them. Keep looking. Right, let's check the artwork bin for Rich. He likes flowers. Hmm. Let me see what the price is on that. That is really pretty. It is a distinct possibility. We'll show him. Paper painting. And found that for a yeah. book. Go me. Alright, let's try this one more time. Actually, two more times. We got one more store after this. Ha! Yeah, never mind. There wasn't even anything cool enough to show you in there. And they had the music super loud, so we're just gonna split and go to the next one. I for real don't even know what to say about this. It's almost the middle of April. <laughs> like, this is horrible. Will it ever stop? Stop snowing. Oh, it's like seriously blizzarding out right now. I don't understand life. You can make a spring snowman with like a bathing suit and a sun cap. <laughs> it's awful. And now the sun's out and the, the fields are steaming. That is crazy. This weather is so weird. You can see more of it in that field. Alright, this is our last stop for today. Let's go see if we can find anything. Hmm, this is still here. White tags are 25% off. Oh, it's busted at the top. Never mind. Ooh, I see something. Jesus, $22.99. Oh, thank you. I'll just wait for an auction. Let's see what else we can get into. Hmm. Tom and Jerry Welch's from 1990. I don't know. It's in really good shape. No clue. Alright, Rich said about $3 if I'm lucky, so I'm putting it back. Alright, we're back at home. Figured I'd do a quick wrap up of what we picked up today. Picked that up for, I think, 3 No, $2.00. Usually do all right with those. Sell them for about 15 bucks on eBay. We got Dare t-shirt. We got Made in Detroit t-shirt. We got the Lamb of God t-shirt, which Rich is keeping. And A 
Budweiser t-shirt. He also picked up brand new sealed. He was telling me this guy died in a car accident. This was his debut album. So he found that and that the painting I have not looked up yet. But if you can tell kind of goes with the theme of this room anyway. <laughs> floral, floral, floral. So that kind of works. And then right as we were leaving, they had put this out. I didn't even see it. Rich caught it. But it is signed Lane. <laughs> so it was a pretty good deal for seven bucks. Plant stands aren't the quickest sell for me, but oh, like 20, 25 bucks, worst case scenario, I'll double my money. So that's that's what we picked up. We were gone all day. It wasn't really the greatest day. Um, but it was something and it filled our day up. So thanks for hanging out with us and we'll do it again soon.